Good morning. Well, let's see. It's about 50 degrees. Foggy. And this morning, I'm going to go get painting down at Memorial Park in Lewis, Delaware. At Memorial Park, it's on Front Street, and there's a bunch of trees like there's a whole row of them that look like that. And I'm gonna go down to the canal on the dock and turn around and look up and paint those trees and the surrounding bank. It's just a beautiful place, and I wanna capture that before all the blossoms fall off. So the car's loaded up with my stuff, and let's go. It's only going to be a high of around 65 today. Should be perfect. Sun breaking through the clouds around uh, 11 o'clock. So, I mean, it's early. It's early now, but I want to get down there so I can get a parking space. So, let's make a left and head down there. Yeah, who knows? Maybe we'll get some clouds, but I'm not focusing on the clouds today. I'm focusing on the trees and there might be a little bit of sky. Uh, yeah, yesterday I was watching this painter on YouTube online called Michael Orwick. And I commented, made a comment about how the technique he was using reminded me of the master painting technique I learned in college where they use wipe away paint and glazing and create a... Uh, the texture, textures and softness for the brushes and to get a good illusion in space. So I may try some of that. It looked kind of interesting. I did some of that in college, like I said, but it's, uh, it's been a long time, <laughs> about 50 years. So we'll see. Should be an experience either way. I'm looking forward to getting out today. Yesterday we were down at Granny Lisa and I went to Bethany Blues in Rehoboth Beach. And it could be in Lewis. It's just sort of on the border of Lewis and Rehoboth, Rehoboth Beach. And they have uh, wing night. And that was last night. You go after 6 o'clock and you get half price wings. So we're sitting there in the bar area on one of those raised tables, the taller tables with tall chairs, high chairs. <laughs> and... Uh, and of course, walking in, I have to grab some crayons and some paper. <laughs> because, hey, that's what I do. I draw, draw with crayons. And they kind of laughed. So we sat down and there was a few people across from us sitting at the bar. And I drew them pretty quick. And then Lisa says, draw the bartender too. So I drew the bartender. He's wearing a Philadelphia Phillies uh, baseball shirt, number 21. So I drew him. Then there were a group of nurses that came in. Uh, they completed their first, I guess, uh, stage of nursing at BB Hospital. They have a training school there. Uh, so they were celebrating. There was about 20 of them, and they asked me to take a picture of them, so I did. Granny, Granny Lisa thinks I do a good job taking photographs, so I turned around and took a picture of this group. I filled up two tables, they really squeezed in there. And then I turn around and Granny Lisa has grabbed my two drawings, my two grand, crayon drawings that were almost finished, almost done. And she gave them to the people I was drawing. <laughs> The people at the so I turn around they're going hey thank you so much thank you we love your pictures thank you so much <laughs> and the bartender said hey why'd you why'd you make my cheeks so chubby like that it's always a tough crowd <laughs> yeah they're not portraits they're caricatures in a way you know portrait caricatures but But it's fun to do. I enjoy it. 
make the people happy. They seem to like my crayon drawings for the most part. Anyway, all right. We're gonna head down New Road and set up when we get to Memorial Park on Front Street and I'll check you later. All right, we're here. See those trees behind me? Aren't they something? Look at that. Look how foggy it is. It's kind of cool. Got to watch out for this ramp though, going down to the dock. Maybe a little bit slippery. The water level is really high right now. Really high. This, this ramp usually is pretty steep going down. You can see this view here. It's a nice view, right? I don't know. I wasn't planning to capture this in the fog. It's kind of a cool scene, though. I'm just going to get some of this. Some of the bank, maybe some people up on the by the railings when they start showing up in a couple of hours. But got some nice reflections there. I sort of wanted to show the beautiful color as the sun comes up with the pink and what the heck was that? <gasps> Sound like a pterodactyl. But look at these boats across here. Isn't that cool? In the fog. I don't know how long it'll take the, the fog to lift. <laughs> Can't see much. I'm going to check the weather and uh, then get set up, I think. All right, check you later. All right, I'm all set up. Got my, uh, going on with sort of a mauve, but purplish wash in background. And I wiped some of it away, as you can see. <clears throat> and then I'm gonna start painting in those uh, purple trees. I mean, the pink trees, cherry trees, and the green foliage in the front. And uh, it's still a little foggy. But I can see it's starting to break up a little bit. So I might be painting in the sky with some blue later on. We'll see. I'm going to see how this goes this morning. and uh, Let's get to it. All right. I got some of the, uh, the underpainting laid in there. The trees and the, the water. The, the foreground there. And uh, I think it's a good start. I'm going to start laying in some of the branches now on the trees. And go from there. All right. All right. So far, I got some more of the underpainting done. It's coming all along a little bit. So, cleaned off my palette. I'm going to get some fresh colors in there. Start painting in some of the greens and maybe some of these rocks down here first. I guess I'll do the rocks first. And then, uh, what happens after that so far so good i think it's coming along all right looks like a mess but i think <laughs> i think it'll be okay once i get some more uh, details in all right let's get to it all right well here's here's what it looks like so far <clears throat> i feel like it's not going all that great i don't know having a little bit of trouble with the water with the rocks with the <laughs> with the grasses over here I don't know, it's like I forgot how to paint. Uh, but anyway, this is what it looks like so far. And uh, the sky is starting to lighten up a little bit. And uh, I'm gonna do some of the greens now, I guess, on the bank. Try and put some of those in. All right, that's it for now. He's having a good time over here. This guy's having a good time right here. <laughs> 
don't know. I'm not doing so good here, but it's nice to know somebody caught a fish at least. Yeah, I'm trying to capture some of this. Uh, it's, it's kind of a gloomy day though, with the fog. And I mean, I like it. I like it like this. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. I don't know. I'm not feeling too good about it though. So just gotta keep at it. Yeah, it's windy. It's killing me. Oh man, it's just blowing me away. Oh really? Okay. I better wrap this up. Okay, well, here's what it looks like so far. It's coming along. Got some of the grains in. Got some of the reflections in. You see the waters. I think the water's starting to move in the opposite direction now. But I got the fence in. I'm going to put in some of the daffodil uh, flowers in there and then try and put in some of the uh, cherry blossoms in there. And that's it, I gotta, gotta move it. All right, that's the progress for now. Okay, I think this is about it. I think I'm almost done, or done. I, uh, I think that's pretty good. I could probably soften some of the texture a little bit or put some darker shadows in the trees. Maybe I'll do just that. And then, uh, then that's it. I like how my palette matches the uh, trees. That's always fun to look at. <laughs> but yeah, that's about it. The wind is coming in strong now. I got to get out of here. I'm going to put a few more darks in the under the trees, and that's it. I'm going home. All right. Well, that's it. <clears throat> I'm home. Uh, not my best outing, but I got some, push the brushes around a bit and got it done. I wanted to get out and paint. And it was kind of an odd day, but got it done. So, nothing to be too proud about. Just, we'll see. We'll see once I get it inside and take a second look. <laughs> Figure out how bad it is. But yeah, the colors weren't quite right. Placement of shapes, not quite right. And uh, the values weren't quite right. And uh, so, it's all done though. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Have a great day.